welcome students let us see a very important question from the topic probability here question is a box contains 10 red marbles 20 blue marbles and 30 green marbles five marbles are drawn from the box what is the probability that first all will be blue and second at least one will be green this question has been taken from ncert book of standard 11 okay little bit tricky but very interesting and simple answer so let us see solution here here total number of marbles how many total number of marbles is equal to 10 red marbles plus 20 blue marbles plus 30 green marbles this is equal to 60 and out of this 60 marbles five marbles are drawn then first case all will be blue what is the probability so that all the five marbles will be blue okay so here we have to find out ns and n e okay so that we could use the formula probability of event e is equal to n e divided by n s so first of all we will try to get this value n s and n e so n s is a number of elements in sample space what is sample space all the possible outcomes in totality so the total marbles is 60 and out of this 60 we have to select any five marbles so ns will be 60 c 5 okay and ne will be number of elements in a favorable event what is favorable event desirable event that we want to have so all will be blue so how many blue are here 20 blue so out of this 20 blue we should have all these five marbles which are taken out drawn okay so ne will be 20 c 5 now by using this formula we can get the answer of this first question all will be blue marble so this is equal to 20 c 5 divided by 60 c 5 so this is 20 c 5 divided by 60 c5 by solving it we'll get the answer so by uh, solving these uh, combinations by using the formula ncr is equal to n factorial by r factorial n minus r whole factorial this is very important and useful formula we are using in almost all questions of the probability so by using this formula we'll get the value this will be 34 divided by 11977 so this is the answer of the first part okay now second part this is first part now second part at least one will be green how to get this probability okay so first of all uh, we'll get the probability that no marble is green okay no marble is green why we are trying to get no marble green because we know a formula that probability of any event a plus probability of not a is equal to 1 so at least one will be green it means there is no chance that marble drawn is not green always it is a green at least one green okay so minimum one green maybe two greens maybe three green maybe four green maybe five green so first of all we will find out this value p not of a and probability of a will be equal to 1 minus probability of not a so let us try to get here the event suppose this event is no marble is green no marble is green 
So N E will be how much? No marble is green, means marbles are either red or blue. So 10 plus 20, out of these 30 marbles, we are taking 5 marbles. So this is 30 C 5. This is N E. Okay. And N S will remain same. 60 C 5. So N S is 60 C 5. Because in totality, we are taking 5 marbles out of total 60 marbles. Okay. So therefore, probability of E means probability of no marble is green. No marble is green. This is equal to N E by N S. So 30 C5 divided by 60 C5. So let us evaluate it. 30 C5 upon 60 C5. This is equal to 117 divided by 4484. So this is 117 by 4484. Okay. Now we have to find out probability of at least one will be green. This is probability of no marble is green. It means we have to find out 1 minus PE. So no marble in green will be subtracted from 1 then we will get at least one marble will be green. So therefore by this formula PA is equal to 1 minus PA naught we can write here P naught E is equal to 1 minus PE this is equal to 1 minus 117 divided by 4484 let us simplify it this will be equal to 14 minus 7 is 7, 7 minus 1 is 6, 4 minus 1 is 3, 4367 divided by 4484. This is the answer. This is the probability that the marble drawn at least one will be green. Fine, very simple. So little bit tricky, but we can understand it very easily. So students remain in touch with these videos. Stay tuned and get maximum benefit of it. And really if you are enjoying learning mathematics here, your likes are most welcome. Thank you very much.